so. Assalamualaikum belum lagi ada ramai lagi yang nak join ni. Okey okey thank you. Okay, okay. Um, okay, everyone. So, welcome and good morning. Uh, I think we we have reached uh, critical mass. Uh, I would like to ask everyone to mute your. Okay, someone is not muting your. Hmm. Okay, and still we have someone want to join. Okay, but I can. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so. So, so everyone can see my slide. Okay, if you don't, you can. Uh, okay. Uh, this session, okay, I'm running on two computers. One, one uh, on my laptop, one on my PC. So, so. Because one session or one Google Meet can only uh, support 250 people. So in total, we have 300 students. But uh, so far, okay, one one session have 100 over 185 students. Okay, and then another session, I think we have around uh, 41. But anyway, in, try to manage this session as best as possible okay uh, this actually session okay 
was supposed to be conducted uh, at the beginning of the semester, but since uh, we have as an issue, which is um, the faculty has decided that your FYP supervisor will be your uh, school industrial supervisors, in the, uh, industrial training supervisor. So they, your this your FYP supervisor will cover the role of uh, school in, uh, industrial training supervisor. Okay, so we have to conduct it today because everyone uh, still uh, on the industrial training. Okay, and by i think by next week uh, we should have uh, a list of your supervisor okay supervisor what i mean by supervisor both final year project supervisor and industrial training supervisor okay <clears throat> before i uh, further go further so i would like to okay introduce the uh FRP committee okay FRP committee cons basically every every de de department or division have a, uh, at least one coordinator okay like division for division uh, our we, we we have to okay we have to uh we have to coordinators okay uh, coordinators from um, PEDG power system and that cover Dr. Rashida uh, and Chizaki cover the EVAT okay Assalam okay Dr. and Chizaki is there okay I heard okay okay Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Okay. Okay. Thank you for coming uh, for uh, joining the session. Okay. Okay. The key. Okay. And then uh, also we have uh, uh, from electronic to coordinator. Uh, Dr. Nurzal covering com and the traffic covering is uh, electronic. Uh, for us. Uh, SKM, we only have one uh, coordinator, uh, Dr. Uh, Tarwan Nima. Okay, space will uh, covered by Dr. Fadli, and also the IT and multimedia, uh, Dr. Auzan, who will manage the sites. Okay, and also the information regarding the information. Okay. So we, uh, you can, we, uh, as you know by now, the, our website, fip.fke.utm.my, you can you can find all the information and latest uh, announcement from there, and also by from time to time I will uh, send you notification through emails. Okay. So. So the website, okay, you, you can find from, uh, uh, you can follow the link that I've given, okay. So basically, it contains all the information regarding FIP, okay, and uh, the important, like for example, important dates, okay, for next semester uh, will be shown on the left side, okay, on the banner. Okay, so I hope you don't miss any information. Everything is there. Okay, it's just uh, up to you to find the information uh, or everything. Uh, I mean, if you want to know uh, the 
format of uh, FYP report. Okay, if you want to know the guidelines for FYP, okay, you want to know the uh, the list of supervisor, and also you want to know the list of examiners. Okay, okay, uh, seminar examiners. It will be on the uh, website. Okay, so basically, final final year project. Okay, you, you must complete before prior your graduation. Eh? Okay, if you don't complete, you cannot graduate. Okay, uh, and 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 this uh, final year project. Uh, it is an individual work. Okay, individual work means that. Um, at the end, you will be evaluated. You you will be evaluated based on your work. But uh, we notice that some students, okay, uh, share the, the main project with your colleague, okay, either voluntarily or maybe so your supervisor uh, suggests you to do it. For example, there's a project, okay. Uh, big project, okay. That project uh, involve hardware and software. So le let's put it like this. Like you, then you decided that okay, you know your your a friend, okay, and then you talk to your supervisor. Okay, that happened that you and your friend, okay, maybe have the same supervisor or maybe different supervisor. That doesn't matter. But you work on a big project, but you basically depending on each other for a big project. Uh, uh, from our experience, we do uh, witness some uh, similar kind of uh, project, and uh, I think from our, as a as a whole, it, it is a big risk uh, because okay you. What, uh, if one part of the project is not working, so as a overall, your project may be not successfully complete. Okay, so we encourage that you work on something that you own by yourself. Okay, I mean you work it. I mean the the the, the completion of the project depend. Okay, on your uh, work. Okay, that uh, 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 what I mean, I didn't. I, I don't mean that you cannot find help or assistance from other student. That, that is okay, no problem. So what I mean, the project. Okay, you must be very careful. Okay, make sure that it solely. Okay depend on on your work okay right so basically you will work independently okay you work independently mean mean that you you own the project okay you you construct the the project but your supervisor okay it, it could the idea could be come from your supervisor but you must show uh, uh, responsibility and you must show passion okay on doing the project okay for example if you are lucky some supervisor will okay already show you what to do some some students are very lucky you know, what to do okay what to do next and then you have to do it okay and some 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 solution okay some your supervisor maybe just point you to the direction but the solution may depend on your creativity okay yeah that's another thing so it's like uh imagine now you are doing industrial training so some tasks okay your your industrial supervisor okay just give a brief or general instruction so you must come up with a solution which is, which is okay of course a solution that it makes sense Okay, in terms of safety, in terms of cost, okay, in terms of time of, of completion, okay. So that is basically what what uh, FYP is basically an extension, okay, extension of your 
uh, industrial training. Okay, so, uh, so that is also one another reason why industrial training is done before FYP. Okay, but I know that now some of you listening to this session did not, uh, I mean, uh, for some reason, okay, did not attend uh, industrial training this semester, I think this third, third semester of 2019-2020, okay, due to the pandemic, uh, pandemic uh, COVID pandemic. But uh, uh, the requirement is that we will, I will uh, explain it later, at least you have completed 90 credit, 90 credit. So, LI basically is a advantage, okay, if you have, have done it before FIP project. But I, I don't think it will be, uh, I mean, it, it will be uh, a strong uh, reason for you not to complete your FIP. So I have seen students who, who did not uh, uh, complete the LI or uh, industrial training after the FIP, they still do good or do uh, very, they excel in uh, FIP project. So don't, don't worry about that. Okay. okay, so basically, uh, in, uh, and then another thing in FIP, in the final year project, everything is documented, so beginning, beginning of your project until the end, until, until the end of your project. And at the end of your project, you have to submit a, a final year project report. Okay, so this Final year project, a final year project report must be submitted. If you do not submit it, you will not be entitled to attend the graduation. Okay, it had happened. Okay, not only here, it also happened, okay, happens uh, in other uh, school. So this is the uh, rule of the university. Nah? So you must submit. Okay, submit the, okay, hang on. Sorry, uh, I'm going back and forward to the main page because someone wants to join. Okay. Okay, so then like I said, uh, at least you must complete 90 credits. Okay. It means that even though you have done your uh industrial training but you haven't uh, fulfilled the minimum requirement of of uh, credit completion which is 90 so you are not eligible to uh register for final year project okay you will be advised to to complete or uh, to collect the credit that, uh, required before you can be registered okay for final year project Okay, so final year project course, okay, split, split it into two, uh, FRP1 and FRP2, okay. So it must be delivered in, in two course consecutive semester, okay. Meaning that there, there should be, shouldn't be any rest. Uh, rest, uh, um, rest, what I mean by rest, for example, this semester you take FRP1, Next semester, okay, you taking, you decided to take uh, rest from, uh, uh, to, uh, from registering uh, FIP2, then you take other uh, subject. So that is not allowed. So you have to do it back to back. But uh, if for some reason, you uh, know, some reason, lah, for example, uh, you have a medical issue, okay, you uh, postpone your semester, the whole semester, meaning that you, the next semester, okay, uh, this semester you take FIP1, next semester you postpone for some reason, lah, health for, uh, issue or, or other issue and then endorse, okay, endorse means that you got the permission from the school, so we, okay, we, 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 we allow that, so mean that when you come back to the school, you continue your study, you can uh, register FRP2. Okay, if, if, yeah, of course, if you are 
uh, pass your FIP1 with, uh, okay. And then the total credit uh, is uh, six, six credits, okay. Uh, so in general, uh, FIP1 uh, in semester one, year four, but this that is just in general, maybe it, a bit different for other students, so that doesn't matter. But uh, and uh, the next semester, okay, next semester back to back, you have to uh, register for FIP two, okay, FIP. The code for FIP one is SKE uh, E for power student, for example, for eight one two and SKE E for eight two four, but. Okay, you have to be very careful. Okay, register register under the correct uh, code. Okay, if you are a SKEE student, so you register for SKEE. If you are a SKEL student, so you register under SKEL. Okay, and, okay, uh, and then you make sure that the code. Okay, the code is uh, FIP uh, one. Uh, you just started to take FIP and also uh, for compulsory registration okay no you don't have to find uh, the coordinator but if you have after okay when beginning of semester if you done you haven't done your early registration pre-registration you haven't done your pre-registration so you have to meet the FIP coordinator Okay, if, if the FRP coordinator is not available, you can find me lah as a chair. So, uh, don't go, uh, don't bypass uh, the FRP committee. Okay, we notice that some students bypass the FRP committee where they go directly to the uh, deputy chair. Okay, because you must go through us because we, we hold the uh, arrangement. Okay, we uh one uh, at least we want to know okay, what is happening okay some student okay uh by last time bypass the uh, frp committee so please don't do that so go through us okay we are the one who okay, hold your marks and who uh, arrange your seminar and so on okay so uh about student and supervisor assignment in general, a student uh, will be distributed based on your program or division. Okay, based on program or division. But since 2012, we have made a, a, um, um, uh, an extra extra arrangement. Some uh, student from, especially from SKE, okay, some student from SKE, it will be allowed to okay do project under uh, uh, SKEL or, or, or electronic department and, and uh, mechatronic department okay so no student from uh, for example from mechatronic can go to other division okay I know some student insist or like Okay, like a project. Okay, uh, already no uh, lecturer from other department. For example, mechatronic. So this this uh, particular student, okay, uh, engage with the lecturer from electronic. For example, okay, then you want to do the project. We we do not allow student to have the main a main supervisor from uh, electronic. Uh, uh, student from mechatronic. KSKM to have a supervisor from electronic. Okay, uh, we do not allow because SKM SKM student ratio to lecturer SKM is is very critical. So if you allow all the student to go out, so there will be less student for for mechatronic lecturers. But we you, 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 what we allow if you let's say you discuss, okay with with uh, some uh, any le lecturer, uh, mechatronic lecturer that uh, you want to do a project with some le uh, electronic uh, lecturer, you can uh, appoint the electronic uh, lecturer from electronic as a co-supervisor. 
So the main supervisor must come from mechatronic. Okay. So uh, we allow some we allow, but but you have to di discuss. Okay, properly. Okay, you have to declare. You must get the consent. Okay, from your main supervisor. Okay, you have to. Okay, politely you have to carefully discuss and then let you have to convince. Okay, it's like um, it's like you talking to your parents lah. You want to go and you have to like carefully because uh, at the end your main supervisor will assess you, not your co-supervisor. Okay. And also, you have to uh, tell your co supervisor you uh, uh, agree with the arrangement. I don't want at the end of the day, okay, your um, co supervisor say, okay, I've been uh, advising you a lot, but your main supervisor got the credit. So that's not the issue. Okay, the main issue is the student. We have a very uh, limited student to be distributed among uh, mechatronic. The division, okay. You have to understand that. But we do have some, you know, uh, 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 gap or something that we can allow or some arrangement lah. We can allow you to do. But it all depends on the situation lah. But if the situation go uh, south, and then we have to okay, uh, not a lot student to do uh, or to do project uh, in other department division but the that is for mechatronic student for uh, power power SKE student okay some of you we allow okay, to uh, do project especially let's say you have engaged with a lecturer from electronic or engaged from lecturer in, in uh, um, mechatronic so Later, okay, you will feel the field of interest. Okay, they will for SKE student, there will be option to select the area from other from other division. Okay, other division SKEL and also SKEE, and make sure that you are really confident that you want to do. And also, the the the, the one the best thing is you have already engaged with lecturer. Okay, and uh in the end of the uh form okay you can suggest a supervisor lah. supervisor for all students you have you can suggest a supervisor okay uh <clears throat> but make sure that you are coming from uh, let's say you have SKE you, you can only uh, uh, uh SKM you can only suggest a lecturer from a mechatronic but and then also uh, if you want your application, um, mean, I mean to be strong, okay, your suggestion to be strong, you, you prove that you have engaged with the, uh, with the suggested uh, supervisor by sending a, a, a letter to the coordinator. Okay, for example, okay, you have engaged with one lecturer and then you have okay discuss email whatever and then you okay, write a formal letter to the your coordinator okay saying that okay this we have engaged with lecturer and this lecturer is agree has agreed okay to take me under my supervision okay uh, and then okay that will help the coordinator to assign you okay to 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 a supervisor okay All right So, and then you are not allowed to change your supervisor. Huh? So once we have uh, assigned you a, a supervisor, so you are not allowed to change. But please be uh, remind that the assignment based on the number of student, the ratio of num uh, student to lecturer. So we cannot assign too many students to one lecturer, okay? Because uh, every lecturer must have so uh, students, huh? so we cannot put everyone or ten students. Uh, 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 Finding your project student to a supervisor. So sorry, we cannot we cannot uh, be, uh, make that that kind of arrangement, okay? 
Hmm. Okay, so uh, we come to the guideline. Okay, we come to the guideline. Uh, so you must register FRP1 okay, according the subject, the correct subject code. So SKE, S, you have to uh, register SKE 4812. Okay, please check your registration slip. Okay. Okay, uh, if you are SKEL student, you have to register for SKEL. Okay. Uh, maybe you think you, uh, let's say SKE student, uh, you uh, you already like, for example, 80%, you, you, you already engage with SKE uh, mechatronic lecturer and what. And then you say, of confirm lah, you want to, you, you are going to do a sign under, under a mechatronic uh, lecturer. But you still have to register for SKE for 182, not SKEM. Okay. So the registration code depend on your program. Okay, not on your uh, uh, supervisor. Okay, I mean uh, the division of your supervisor. Okay. Student so may withdraw, withdraw FIP 1. Uh, okay, FIP 1. Uh, but you, but student cannot withdraw FIP 2. Cannot withdraw FIP 2. FIP 1 still, but I mean, because we have to do FIP back to back. Uh, but if you withdraw for, for a reason that is allowed by the school, okay, we we will discuss. We will take that matter and we will discuss that matter. Okay, basically, you, basically you can can only withdraw FIP one. Okay, but we don't encourage you to withdraw lah. Okay, and then uh, okay, uh, you must record or your progress on the logbook. Uh, so this arrangement uh, based on uh, the current situation where student will, we assume that uh, fourth year student will come back, all the FRP1 will come back. Okay, uh, I mean uh, all fourth year student will come back okay, in stages or, or eventually you will come back. Lah. So you must uh, acquire a logbook you must buy the logbook, purchase it from the the office. Okay, don't don't ask the coordinator or uh, chair. We we do not sell. We just arrange. School we okay, uh, will arrange. Uh, and then uh, logbook is not still uh, not available yet for next semester because you will come start coming back on the 18th, 18th of October, right? Okay, so it will be available after that time, lah. Okay. And then uh, the, you must attend the online research methodology. Sorry, the date is not correct. The date is around a week after, uh, after uh, second week, second week. I think it's 20, 18, uh, so 18 it will be on uh, Sunday, 19, 20, around 27, 27 of October. Okay, 27 of October, okay, on uh, Tuesday. Okay, to, to I think we also will conduct it online because we have so limit uh, we, because uh, in basically okay what we were told um, face to face uh, class must follow the SOP yeah, standard of, uh, of, of SOP uh, COVID-19 so cannot we cannot have uh, I think Mm, in in one class cannot have more like more than 20 students like, if you have a small class huh? but we have a large we have, there must be physical distancing so we cannot you know accommodate all 300 students so uh, again we have to conduct the online research methodology online lah, the the research methodology online but i think i don't, I don't think it's a problem because uh, now uh, we will split that research methodology according to your division okay so the uh, every coordinator will conduct uh, by separately lah, based on the uh, program okay so um, the and then there's a 
the last time that they they will be they, they we were we have had uh, the information seeking calls from the library i think because of the pandemic i will try to ask the library whether they can conduct an online session or maybe they can have a recording we can share with you uh, how to find information from the uh, database okay or from the internet or how to find a credible uh, source for your project okay it's not just finding any kind of source you have to find a uh, academic source okay uh, proper academic source okay like journal and conference papers books okay you uh, you can get information from uh, website but website uh, the thing is that website will not be on the internet forever and also it's, it's, it's not a credible source okay you can you can get knowledge but it's not a proper or official uh, source okay and uh, uh, FIP action plan okay will be finalized uh, before the uh, semester or before on at least on 18 of October Okay, and then uh, our action plan will uh, I will announce through email. Okay, share with the file also pull on the website. Okay, and then give the summary of the action plan on the website. Okay. Then you are not allowed to repeat uh, FIP. You repeat grade. It's not like a, a, a regular subject where you can repeat your grade. So no the FIP you cannot repeat your grade lah. so if that is the grade you get so you have to settle and then you have to live with it and that's why you have to okay put uh, the best effort for FIP okay especially uh, uh, listening to your supervisor lah. Okay, this is a past example lah. The past example, not the current example. Uh, student who registered the wrong code. Okay, for example, SKEL, student program. Okay, and then registered for SKE. Okay, so you have to be, 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 be careful lah. Okay, uh, oddly, very strange, you know, it will happen. There will be some case. Okay every semester but i hope it's not will will not happen uh, next semester okay logbook will be available this is a sample uh, of past semester uh this logbook uh, it, it is uh, it's a physical form physical form so uh, i feel that you must have this logbook you want to record everything okay and then is this uh, this logbook contain everything Okay, the regulation, information of the coordinator, uh, important dates, the form with the uh, detail of, of, of your uh, prog uh, evaluation, okay, the rubrics, the elements, so everything there. Let's say you want to know how do you, how are you going to be evaluated for, for the first uh, progress, okay, for the first progress evaluation. So we put all the element. So you have to highlight or you have to be, okay, pay attention to the details. Okay, so you can strategize. Okay, you can have a good strategy how to get uh, A or A plus for your project. Okay. So this logbook will be available on the, uh, from the uh, school office. Okay, uh, beginning on 18 October, I hope you will be available on 18 October. I know that some of you still cannot come uh, back, maybe, especially internal student, students. Okay, you can ask your colleague or your friend to you already uh, in, the, in, the, in the school, okay, to okay, uh, manage or arrange Okay, something uh, uh, like, for example, uh, um, post the book. Okay, 
to you okay okay so this is uh, basically the uh, action plan yeah, okay action plan sorry hang on the action plan okay so please look at the important dates okay for example today uh we have a FIP briefing okay and then uh, the FIP submission sorry it is supposed to be on uh, 12th of uh, September lah today until uh, 19th of September uh, 2020 so the form is already open okay already open so maybe you can if you have decide to pick your uh, uh, field and then you can go or uh, if you haven't this uh, if you want to know the field uh, the area you can okay look at the form okay don't and then uh, don't don't press submit yet on at, uh, uh, at the end lah you can go next next field okay and then you you can put the you can suggest a supervisor uh, on uh, at the end of the frp1 form okay it is open now until next week okay and then by uh, 25th of uh, september okay we the so uh, our job uh, the committee is to assign your supervisor so this supervisor will be your fip supervisor and also your li supervisor li uh, the school school li supervisor okay now we are in the briefing so on the 27th of uh, October, uh, we have uh, research methodology. So it will be conducted online. Online, okay. We'll separate by division. Uh, um, and okay, and the progress evaluation, okay, 10%, okay, marks. You evaluate your progress, okay. FIP is one of the arrangement is to evaluate your progress okay the uh, it's not only the end of the point end of the uh, end product of your fip but also your progress okay so you notice the date date is the final date okay for you to uh, fill this uh, uh, make an entry to e-portfolio so there's another requirement so you have to make a summary of your progress and then uh, upload I make uh, the, your supervisor already been uh, informed to create a page a supervisor page and then that's you have to find the supervisor page and then you have to submit to your supervisor okay your your progress it's a summary okay summary but uh, it's, it's not you copy back everything you wrote on your logbook logbook is a um, okay it's a book to you record your progress but this first submission of e-portfolio e is okay uh okay to to summarize what you have done from week one to week five okay and then your supervisor will evaluate okay your progress based on your e-portfolio entry and also your logbook logbook money means that he okay when you, every time you meet your supervisor you have to meet i suggest you have to meet every once a week but uh, of course your supervisor some somehow are very busy okay you can always communicate when uh, at least uh three, two weeks or three weeks or even you cannot find your supervisor physically what you can do can you write an email okay uh, dear sir we already i already done this done that okay so, and then you sign, send an email okay okay so you, you show your effort uh, you show your effort okay uh, okay and then al always always find uh, other ways of cre creative way to 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 do your work okay and then the evaluation second evaluation come on the week ninth okay uh, at the end, uh, somewhere on the end of the year, okay, December, in uh, please uh, take note of the dates. Nah. So the date there is where the, the last date you have to 
make an entry. Okay. And then uh, evaluation progress. Uh, third one will be week 12. Okay, next year. Seminar will be before the semester, uh, the study week. Semester from the study week. Okay. Uh, this is uh, something that I always repeat every every time, every year. I have to remind you that next semester you will also uh, conduct or involve with Capstone. Okay. Capstone is a uh, <coughs> work project, uh, work, uh, mean team project, team work project. So you work in the group, okay, for lab, Cap Capstone lab. And then, uh, unfortunately, usually lah, the capstone seminar will fall in the same week, okay? <coughs> which is the week 15. Okay, for example, usually uh, capstone uh, seminar will uh, be only, uh, will on one day, uh, will be held on, on a day, <coughs> let's say on Monday, and then on, and and then the same week, maybe a Tuesday, Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, the one of the day will be your FIP seminar. <coughs> so the schedule is not up yet. So that week, week 15 is will be very busy. It will be very busy. So you must plan your work very carefully. You have to be prepared. Uh, physically, mentally, yeah. okay. Uh, I <coughs> remind you now because at the end of the day, there will be always student complain about time management. Yeah. I'm sure I have to remind you early, okay. The, the, the week 15 will be very busy, okay. That's one thing, and another thing, there's a probability things will be uh, will come back to movement of control order PKP. Maybe, okay, because last semester, okay, we have to change everything. I mean, in term, especially the uh, seminar, okay, we, so we have to conduct the seminar online. Okay, so if everything, okay, back to movement of control, movement, uh, movement, con uh, <coughs> uh, control, uh, mo CMO, uh, control of movement order or PKP so we will change the evaluation method okay but we will inform you weeks way week before before uh, yeah before the actual day or the actual seminar okay don't worry we we uh, alhamdulillah we we uh, FRP committee had the experience okay but now we stick on face-to-face uh, -face evaluation. So face-to-face -face evaluation. So if we have face-to-face -face evaluation, it will be done on, it will be carried out on week 15. Okay. <coughs> so a week after your presentation, a week, one week, you have to send a draft okay, to your supervisor. Okay, draft and then your supervisor will check quickly and then send it back two or three days later you you make the correction you submit to the second reader so there will be two people reading your report your supervisor and also a second reader or second evaluator which is other lecturer maybe one of your uh, <coughs> seminar panels okay one maybe one of your seminar panels okay usually like one of your seminar panels uh, will evaluate so two people will read or evaluate your report. Okay. Seminar loan will carry about thirty percent, lah. Thirty percent. Okay. You can see the the the, the rubrics or the details of the presentation from the form which is in the logbook. Okay. And then <clears throat> and also in week sixteen you have okay your supervisor will evaluate your e portfolio entries. Okay, e portfolio entries. And that will carry about 10%, 10% of the marks. Okay, and then, okay, that's the end or the final date you to submit uh, uh, for e-portfolio. 
okay every portfolio and also the final date to send your final draft to to your to your supervisor okay and then after a few days after you submit to your supervisor you have to submit to the second reader okay each of the evaluator will carry 15 percent the second evaluator will 15 percent your supervisor 15 percent okay and then you have to submit okay the uh <coughs> complete everything before week 18 because we want to uh, submit the, the the mark okay so this is the breakdown of your uh, marks okay progress in total 30 percent okay at three time okay at week five nine and twelve so that in total 30 percent seminar seminar 30 percent okay seminar is 30 percent okay seminar coming from your panel two panels uh, we will average let's say you have two panel at least two panels we average the marks huh? okay 30 percent report Okay, from the supervisor, 15%. From your second examiner or second reader, 15%. The portfolio, 10%. So, it's also your supervisor, basically half. It's just a bit over half, lah, 55%. Okay, and then the rest from your panel and your your, your uh, panel or seminar panel. And then your <coughs> report, uh, second uh, evaluator report. Uh, reader okay so this is in 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 general of the assessment okay uh progress everything you write down uh, manually on your logbook so logbook just in case okay i know uh, we already have online and then e portfolio but e portfolio just, ref just reflect the summary of your whole, your progress, not the whole thing. That the logbook is this is valuable for is very valuable because it is a a, a a week to week guideline. So there are many okay. Uh, if you don't have any idea or don't have a clear <coughs> uh, make a clear way to conduct your FYP, the logbook will guide you okay for with question. Okay, we question uh, already and we still have student want to join. Okay, anyway. Uh, maybe we already at, at the end of our uh, <coughs> session. Okay, so uh, these are for the just guideline for the e portfolio. Okay, e portfolio entry. It's not log book, log book is you write everything uh, every day or every week. Okay, if you have idea, you write on your log book, you draw on your log book. But uh, e portfolio is a summary. Okay, summary uh, for your week uh, period progress like say from week one to week five and then weeks five to week nine okay and so on and then okay <clears throat> so these are basically the chart lah, chart uh, uh, for e portfolio first uh, supervisor must create a group okay so you have to remind your supervisor lah Okay, don't, don't, okay, just uh, sitting quietly, okay, don't do any action, don't do any portfolio entry when you realize that your supervisor haven't created a, a group. So remind your supervisor because we already uh, conducted a, <coughs> a workshop for your supervisor. Our, uh, our uh, FRP committee already, okay, show step by step to your supervisor so they should already know how to create the supervisor group okay uh, and then uh, okay the flow okay you have to request to be a member of the supervisor group okay and then you make the entry 
So the e portfolio entry minimum three, three entries. Okay, but if you are so, you know, uh, okay, so hardworking and then so very okay, uh, <coughs> eager to, to do your FIP, you can make a lot of in the portfolio entry, but okay, basically, if too many is too very difficult for the supervisor to check, lah. the minimum entry is three. Okay. <coughs> All right, so uh, I think uh, that's all the end of the uh, uh, briefing. Chef uh, Papi 2, we will conduct another briefing uh, briefing uh, to show you the, the, the um, how to, this, uh, to expose you to the planning of the project, Chef Papi 2 project. Okay, so basically Chef uh, Papi 2, Okay, uh, of course, you, you have to uh, register for the correct, correct, uh, correct code. Okay, and then for too, you cannot withdraw. Okay, you cannot withdraw. Okay, unless you very, uh, very serious issue, that's another thing we can discuss. Okay, but you cannot withdraw, especially student who withdraw without telling the FRP community. Okay, the consequences if you withdraw FRP two, okay, the consequences. This is stated in uh, in the rule. You can check for in the logbook. If you withdraw FRP two, you have to repeat FRP one. Not okay, if you withdraw, you, then the next semester you you will not be allowed to register FRP two. You have to repeat FRP one. So th this is already stated in the rule. So you, the, it had been discussed, it had been uh, minute, okay, in, uh, written in the mid, uh, minute of the meeting, okay, and it has been endorsed by the committee and, and the school. Okay, so you use your logbook, okay, uh, okay. showcase for FRP2, there could be a showcase, like a, but it all depend on the uh, arrangement or, or, or the budget lah. but we will announce, announce that later lah, uh, next year but don't worry later in, in when you do FRP2 that we will, we will happen uh, <coughs> uh, it's still a long way to go okay, the FRP2 uh, this is the breakdown of the mark a bit different where 5% uh, of the mark of the progress Okay, will be uh, is is moved to the presentation. Okay, presentation because FRP two you have to show or demo your project demo. Okay, you you have to after the presentation you have to show your working project to your panel. So the 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 evaluation uh, element are much uh, more than uh, than FRP one lah. Okay, this is the summary. Okay, similar to FRP one, except that you have a e portfolio. Okay, e portfolio, uh, same but uh, similar to FRP one. Okay, and then you have uh, the uh, report. Report uh, there will be uh, your lecturer and then your second reader will read the report and then evaluate. Okay, so I think uh, that's all from my side so far. Uh, so I open uh, to the floor if you have any question you want to ask. Okay. Just uh, check the... Hello, doctor. Yes. Uh, doctor, can we have the slide? Like, can you please email us the slide? Okay. Yeah, and Doctor, I want to ask the our next semester is going to be face to face. Okay, um, I the arrangement is that uh, for FIP, FIP will be blended. Blended means that uh, if you are here, you can you, uh, you can meet your supervisor. Lah. If you are not here, then then you you have. To arrange a meeting with a supervisor online or whatever, 
Okay, uh, and uh, for the research about technology, we have to conduct online because we have a large number. Uh, and we cannot, if you break down into many sessions, so we will not finish. Okay, and uh, for other subject, they will announce that two weeks before before the semester start. I mean, for certain subject, okay, they will decide whether it will be online or the, it will be face-to-face -face or will it be blended. Face-to-face -face is uh, for other subject very difficult because you have, in one session, you have to limit the number of students. Okay, so lecturer will, you know, have to conduct many classes every week. Okay, and I think maybe if they really want to finish, let's say they want to put a face to face, they have to finish it. Uh, you have, you have, you have, you have to conduct uh, uh, some lecture in at, at the night <laughs> until the end of the semester. Mm -hmm. But for FIP, uh, I have now I declare it's blended. I mean, if if you have it depends on you discuss with your supervisor if you, if you can manage meet him to meet your supervisor face to face with physical distancing, that's okay. And also lab, lab, okay, they allow. For fourth year, they allow, you just have to, you have to go to the lab and then ask the them how, the, uh, how is the arrangement. Okay, for lab, you want to find or you want to get the permission, don't ask our committee. We, we just, uh, we just uh, point you the direction. Uh. So if you want to want to, to know how to, to, to access the lab, you have to go to the lab ask the assistant engineer or the lab, uh, the head of the lab, uh, okay? Okay, doctor. And doctor, the final exam is going to be like for this semester, the final exam is uh, uh, will be late, like, right? Like not in the February, right? Because uh, like uh, because this time the semester is going to be started lately, like uh, in October, not in September. Yeah. So the final exam is going to be one yeah. month later. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, mean, I think uh, the date, that I show on the slide uh, based on the current or the latest uh, some uh, timetable. Okay. Uh, yes, I think it will be on. Let, let me check quickly. Final exam will be around February. Final, uh, yeah, February. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it will be around February. Oh, uh, yes, early February until the end of February. Okay, yeah, okay. But I don't know whether the exam will be face to face or online. I don't know. Uh, okay, doctor. Okay. okay. Right. Yeah, no problem. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay, with that, uh, thank you everyone uh, for joining. Sir, can okay. I ask? Uh, yes, one sir. There are many questions here. I want to okay. call it, is the supervisor must be the same with our intern SV or can we choose another? Intern SV? No. <clears throat> Sorry. Intern SV, intern SV is intern. Now let's. I know some of you are doing doing uh, li inside the university, right? Ah yes. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, and I, mean, I know that is the. But you can suggest other oh, for your okay. FIP. No problem. Thank you. Yeah, let's say you you haven't. I mean. Uh, you haven't no you don't know who is your supervisor or you don't suggest any supervisor we, we will assign lah. but if if you but you can put the in the supervisor suggestion form you can you, you, you can put a note my current uh, li supervisor is uh, and you can put a note there okay um sorry doctor uh -huh. Uh, yeah, so uh, I uh, uh, for me, I already write uh, wrote a letter uh, to mm. reserve 
to reserve for our, uh, uh, my supervisor for FYP. Uh, mm. So uh, I, I will be I will be following. And my my SP will be the one I have uh, the one that I have written in my letter, right? What about that? Um, so uh, so previously I have wrote a letter uh for reserve for reserving uh, my own supervisor my own FYP su supervisor. So uh so does it mean that uh now my FY my FYP supervisor will be the one that I've reserved in my letter or will be assigned later? It let it all depends. Okay, I have two questions here about about the supervisor and also one question about the uh, project 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 that you want to conduct. Yeah, I answer a question about the supervisor. You can suggest a supervisor. Okay, you can suggest, but it all depends on a, a few things, lah. For example, okay, happen. Uh, the, the, you 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 are coming from let's like, say mechatronic and then you suggest to mechatronic lecturer and then the lecturer is available then that's okay okay but if it's a bit complicated okay you suggest from other division okay so we have to discuss uh, that uh, uh, <coughs> we have to discuss on, and then we have to make uh, other arrangement lah. okay but usually if your supervisor agree, your, your potential supervisor agree, you suggest that we have no problem. Okay, we have no problem. Usually, you know, we just give. But I know, I also, secondly, it depend, it depend on the number, number of students. Uh, if too many students request for the same supervisor, so we cannot, we cannot do that. So, unfortunately, we have to, okay, assign you to other lecturers. Okay. And then about the question uh, whether uh, the title, whether your supervisor uh, will give you a title or you want to do, it all depends on your skill to discuss with your supervisor. Okay. Some supervisor, okay, suggest you do this and then you have to follow. But Let's say you come to your supervisor and then you can uh, convince your supervisor that you are you prefer something different, okay? And then you can do this, uh, and then you have to convince, nah. Well, so FIP is not necessarily you do, you do what your supervisor, uh, but what what is more important is that you complete complete the project. Uh, you excel, lah. You excel. Okay, you 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 complete. I mean, you show you show that okay, you have achieved. You can achieve something. Okay, good. Okay, and then you you can show it again, and then your your supervisor appreciate. Okay. Okay. So okay. many question here. Yeah. Just yeah. you just now you mentioned that SKL are not allowed to choose school. Okay. 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 Does SKL could choose supervisor for yes? I, choose. I mean. Uh, we do have some SKL student, okay, SKL, SKL, I think, uh, to SKM, I think so far, no, SKL because uh, you have, SKL also have very limited student, okay, SKL student, okay, usually distributed among as, uh, electronic division. Only SKE, SKE, okay. Some SKE student go to uh, electronic and also go to uh, uh, mechatronic. Okay, okay. Even though I didn't go to industry, am I allowed to take? Yes. Like the requirement is that you must complete ninety credit, ninety credit, nine nine zero. So you have completed 90, zero, 90 credit, 90 credit, okay? If you have completed 90, 90, uh, 90 credit, so you get, you are allowed to, to take FIP. So you, if you have done your industry training, that's, that's okay, actually. I think, I think I heard that you, you receive information from the school, uh, from, I think, I was, I was, I also got the same email that, that's stating that if you haven't go for industrial training, you cannot take FIP knowledge. That's not, that's not true. 
the, that is not the arrangement. Okay, uh, basically you have to complete at least 90 credit. Okay, you 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 calculate lah yourself. When you calculate, by now you should have known how many subject you have completed. Yeah? Because you have to calculate, you have to you have to declare in the form. So you have one week, you have to calculate. Okay. Okay. What else? Uh, doctor, doctor. Yes, yes. Doctor, sorry to interrupt. Um, the Google form got problem. We, I tried to uh, mm. pick the options for the scam program. They will be the uh, from the most one to least yeah. three desirable in the rank section one. But then I choose yeah. only one from each row, but it show out that please don't select more than one response per column. But I only choose one. Pardon, uh, Bosco, uh, can you repeat that question? Uh, now, currently, I'm filling the Google form for the scam program for the rank section. Uh, okay. Section? Section? Uh, for, the, for the ranking section. Uh. The writing section? Uh, yeah. Uh, there will be what scam program then there will be they asked us to choose the ranking of the type of the uh, things you are going to have interest in doing in your FYP. You mean, you mean the FYP 104 form? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you, you just pick whatever you feel very, you know, you you keen on do. Yeah, yeah, the, the problem is I only choose one from each row. But yeah. then the there will be there will be an error showing that please don't select more than one response per column. But there, oh, there are only three there are only three columns. So how can I not overlap the? Oh, the, there's an error. Like, error. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There, will, there are only three 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 options. Okay, we we will look into that. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right. Is the internship SB is same as FYP? Uh, yes, is is the internship SB will be the same of FYP SB, but but if you suggest different FYP FYP SB, you 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 state like I said, you stated in the form. Okay, my current internship SB is who and that, but uh, my I suggest uh, different FYP SB. Okay, but if you put the okay FIPSB just one name, then we assume that is going to be your uh, the same intention as B, nah. Okay. Mm. Link next supervisor. Okay, form form you form like I have mentioned you can find from the website. Okay. Unable, unable to submit. There, there's a bug. Okay, okay. Uh, we, we, we will look back into the form later. Okay. I will inform uh, Dr. Afzan there's a problem. Okay. okay we are, uh, regarding FRP10, we will check. Okay, we will check the form and then uh, later we will inform you uh, uh, whether the form is already rectified. Okay, correct the problem. Okay, thank you for uh, noticing the problem. Okay. All right. How, how do I know who is my intern supervisor? Intern supervisor, your intern supervisor? Uh, if you don't know who is your intern supervisor, which that means you are you are doing you are doing in the industry, industry yeah, so that industry supervisor. But school in school intern supervisor, we 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 okay we will if you don't have the school intern supervisor, we'll assign the same supervisor as your car service supervisor lah. Deadline to fill is next week. Yeah, 20, we said a week. A 
two weeks. We give you one week time until 19 of 19, 19, 19 of uh, September. Okay. Yeah, okay. nine, 90 credit required, if you, yeah, 90, 90 credit include internship lah. Uh, yeah. So Dr. Like uh, for the students who haven't signed for the internship this semester, like mm -hmm. uh, so at first I need to contact the course coordinator, right? Course coordinator of what? Internship? Yeah, no, no, I mean for the FYP. I need to contact the, actually I'm from SKEL, so I need to contact Dr. Afi. For? For my supervisor, like who is going to be my supervisor for my FYP? No, no, no. You do. You, you um. You don't have to contact. Uh, I mean, I mean, if you if you have like engaged with the with the lecturer. Okay, you have engaged a lecturer, and then lecturer agree, and then you write a letter, and then yeah, you 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 can contact, uh, Doctor Afi. Okay, and uh, yeah, and then you put the supervisor name in the FIP one zero form, and later lah, FIP one zero has left back. Okay, but but Doctor, like I haven't completed any lecture still for FIP. I so mean, if you so if you haven't contact any lecturer, then you don't know what we do. We will assign you based on the area that you select. Oh, okay. Area, area, area. Okay. okay yeah, then you just say you don't know or you are not sure. Okay. Uh, uh, right. So to whom, whom should I contact? Like I want to do my project on uh, uh, microelectronic based. Like maybe MOSFET or something, nanotechnology, something like that. So that that one, I, I I leave it you for you to contact Doctor Afik lah because he is the you know uh, I mean in the same field. Mm -hmm. uh, you can ask for for his uh, opinion, Doctor uh, okay. Afik. Okay. 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 Yeah. All right. Okay, I think uh, we have come to the end of our uh, session. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. The thing, the thing, yeah. Sometimes, sometimes internet, sometimes internet has a server. Pro I don't know. You can try again lah. For those who, who cannot submit the form, you can try later. You can try later. Okay? okay thank you Dr. Karun Hamima for testing the form. Okay. Alright. Okay. Uh, with that, if you have more questions lah, it's okay lah. If you have more questions, you can ask the, the, the committee. They send email whether to me or to other other coordinator okay thank you very much and i hope all the best for you everyone and then uh, see you back in utm safely lah. okay take care of yourself okay be safe okay thank you sir okay Bye.